What's up, filmmakers? Today on Fourth Film Vlog, we talk cameras part two plus we pronounce with six million in Igbo. <laughs> Before we start today, last week I got this email and I think we should do some justice to it. Nakadu. Okay. I like what you're doing. Okay. Afana. Okay, at this point, can someone please explain to me, how do you answer that question properly? Do you say 500 kilometers or maybe I'm far? I don't even know. Anyways, just for the fun of it, can you pronounce 56 million naira in Igbo? Mwane pasagodi udo? Mwane pasagodi udo? Hey, udo, 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 I like my language. Okay, there's so many things right with that email. But because you asked, here's my trial. Pukunare, pukunare na iris iseni si. Pukunare, pukunare, naranjari, no, naran. Hmm. Naranjari Naira. Iri ni si. 56 million. I released my first episode of What Cameras to Buy last week. If you haven't seen it, please click on the link somewhere on the screen and watch it and come back to this one very quickly. I'll wait for you. Today, we go a little in depth. Understanding how a camera works will help you to a great extent in becoming a better cinematographer. And starting out, there are a few terms you need to be comfortable with. ISO, aperture, measured in f-stop or t-stop. Shutter speed, color temperature, measured in Kelvin. Sensors, dynamic range, speed depth, and the list goes on. So before I start speaking jargon, let's pretty much get used to the basics. Here are parts of cameras since we'll be using those terms a lot. The body, the lens, in a better term, the front side and the back side. Or better still, in Kiruka. Anazoka. Going on, the body consists of the shutter, aka the gate, the sensor that light falls on to create images. In as much as other parts play a role in creating images, let's just get acquainted with these two for now. Starting on ISO. ISO meaning International Standardization of Organization is the level of sensitivity of your sensors to light. The higher the value, the more light you let in, the brighter your images get. The lower the value, the less light you let in. It ranges from about 100 to 400,000 in mirrorless cameras. During daylight shooting, most people prefer to shoot on the native ISO, which is about 100 and sometimes 800 in certain cameras. But I must warn you, in many ways, think of ISO as a typical Nigerian party. The more people you let in, the noisier it gets. And trust me, you don't want to go above 800. F-stop or T-stop. Usually, this is found on the body of the lens. It is the size of the opening of the aperture. This guy here. Measured in values of 1.4, 2.8, 3.2, 4.0, 5.6, and so on, up to values of f22 to f32. The smaller the value, the larger the aperture. An aperture of 1.4 will look like this. And an aperture of f22 will look like this. These values also have effect on the depth of field. Lenses with apertures of 1.4 are regarded as fast lenses because of how wide they can open and how much light they can let in. Lenses of lower f-stops are regarded as slow lenses. Now shutter speed. In so many ways, the shutter speed of a camera is controlled by the gate, which we called shutter earlier. It is measured per second, meaning it's the amount of time the gate closes or opens in one second, which also means the amount of time the sensor is exposed per second. Usually, in DSLR cameras, these values are kept at 1 over 50, and in certain cameras, when they are measured in angles like the Blackmagic cameras, they are kept at about values of 180 degrees meaning is the amount of time the gate opens in one second. And finally, color temperature. Color temperatures are measured in Kelvin, 3200 Kelvin for warm and 5600 Kelvin for cold. To fully understand this concept, I'll attach a link down below explaining in full details of what color temperature is all about and how it can help you create better images. For now, the best way to understand this concept is to get out and shoot as many times as you possible. Experiment with these values and see what you achieve. Next week, we talk sound, lenses and our first short film until then i remain your sincerely faithful the professional minister of Indian double prince plc take a frank and i just filmmaker you can like my page on facebook at first film and follow me on instagram for daily set life at victor underscore o frank and on twitter as well at victor underscore o frank until i see you next week stay shooting and i'm out